Guess who's visiting me in New York City? Da -da 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 -da. Yay! It's my brother! <coughs> oh gosh. These are our outfits today. I wanted to show you guys. So this is actually all Isabelle's clothes. <laughs> this jacket is from Carhartt. Isabelle's Brandy Melville hoodie, my belt, Martin Rose, Carhartt pants, the stitching on the outside, we love those. This is my outfit, my jacket is from Depop, and then my pants are from Meow. And then I have this cutie little purse, it's just a Brandy Melville purse, and my earmuffs. But we're gonna vlog today because he's visiting me in New York for the first Yes. Time! We're gonna go to Bryant Park right now and we're gonna go visit the Christmas Village. But I also got a new camera. This is like my favorite camera. My skin's glowing on it. I swear my skin doesn't look like this in real life, but it makes you look flawless. And a lot of people ask me what camera I use. So this is the vlogging camera that is currently my go-to. It's the Sony ZV-1F. And I love it because it's so compact and easy to bring around. I also just wanna give Sony a big shout out for sponsoring this video. This is my favorite camera I've ever used and it's about time I upgraded because I'm a beginner and this is the perfect camera for people who are just starting out like me. I have like the tiniest purses and this fits in perfectly. It's the perfect vlog camera and my phone hasn't been cutting it. So I have this one now. It lets you flip the camera so I can actually see my face on this little screen. And there's a big red border for when you're recording because I'm very airheaded when it comes to whether or not I'm actually, I actually push the button. Do you see that little screen? Endless, you can zoom in. And you can also have wide angle. How amazing. It worked. I didn't know, so I didn't know you could Apple Pay now on the subway. Okay, so we're at Times Square Station, and there's always so much going around because it's so busy. But we just got here, and we're gonna walk to Bryant Park. At least this camera picks up my sound really well. It has a little fuzzy mic because if it wasn't for this camera, I don't think you could hear shit, especially on my iPhone. So much going on all the time. Come on. The reality of New York is walking fast. Sorry, I'm a little slow. But no matter what pace we're at, this camera is like super stable and it doesn't shake. Even if we run. Ah! <laughs> I can't believe I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> city of Lights! <laughs> it's literally not the City of Lights. What? It's not the City of Lights. What is it? The Big Apple. <laughs> I literally want to eat everything. <laughs> We're trying to find this like melted cheese sandwich because I saw it online. And they literally, it's like a raclette cheese sandwich, but I'm going to zoom in on that cheese pool. That's you guys a are talker gate kept the place, so I had to search up Times Square cheese raclette sandwich. I'm so excited to eat it. It should be right here. Bro, it's supposed to be here. It's literally a trash can. The hell? Oh, wait, right there! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I'm hungry. We're almost at the front. It smells so good. She wants two sandwiches, and I want one because I want to eat more things here. But, but wait till you see the cheese pool. There's so many people around us, and there's so much going on, but this still stays in such high quality on photo and video. Ham and salami. We'll get the, the these top two ones. Yeah. Thank you. You guys? Oh, oh, oh my god, bro. Yeah, ready? You're ready? 
Oh, that looks so good. Is it really good? <laughs> Everyone's looking at us because we we got two. Everyone else shared. Mmm. Bro, look at these sandwiches. Show me yours. You see that pickle oh, in there? Oh, they put a pickle. That's so yum. Dude, this is actually so good. The bread's so soft. Nine out of ten. Bro. It's good. It's, it's not that. Yeah. Can I say hi? You can say hi. Hold on. <laughs> hi. You said we should have gotten one. Do you still think we should have gotten Never one? Never mind. Yeah, I want Never bag. mind. I want to buy that one. Wait, did I try yours yet? Hey. <laughs> I thought I was getting the bite. No! So we don't know, that's nasty! Wait, this camera is so good. It gets it like perfectly. But this is like worth the wait. It took us about only 20 minutes, I think. I've waited like over two hours before for Ding Tai Fung. So, this is really good. If you can get it for the experience, I'm on a date. I'm with my brother though. Sibling date. We're single. So it's starting to rain and it's getting darker and everyone's getting off work visiting now. But luckily, I have my brother holding this umbrella. Now we are going to taste test holiday drinks because I have never tried Christmas menu items before. So we ordered the whole menu just now. This? There is an ice passion tango tea lemonade. Yeah, so Why I got... did you get the ice passion tango tea? Because I like passion fruit stuff. That's literally not even a holiday. Okay, you know I'm it's more, fine. I'm more of a fruit guy. The right. point is a taste test of the holiday ones. Well, now passion tango is a holiday drink. So we're gonna show you guys everything we just got. There's three more. What the just hell? Literally, you said go all, go all out. You know what? I'm just gonna start with this because I want this now. It looks too good. Tango tea. I want, I want this. this. It looks, it looks too, good. too good. Oh. So now we get to taste test the entire Starbucks holiday drink menu. Thumbnail. I feel really bad for the person who made all these. Did you tip them well? Of course. Always tip your blue collar workers. That was a dish. Uh, I'm not gonna say anything else. I talk too much. Okay. Yeah, you're fine. Don't say that. You don't talk too much. <laughs> Let's use this product showcase setting. The first drink. This is the sugar cookie almond frappuccino. There we go. Okay. Ooh, so first off. I'm looking at the list. I'm trying to stay. Is that one good? <laughs> you do that too? <laughs> we're all like, we're just like. You do that too? No, because there's a bitterness that I'm trying to. Trying to figure out what it is. That's a three. Sorry. Yeah. Then we have the iced peppermint white mocha. Okay. This, this one, one better will probably be pretty good. Mm. You try it first. This one I like. It's just peppermint. It's just so holiday. -y. Oh my gosh, this is really good. Yeah. Oh, I love this one. I've actually never had a peppermint mocha. If you were to step outside and it was snowing, this this would be the drink that you like, should drink. This is what I wish snow tasted like. Sense. <laughs> That's a nine. That's a nine. That's a nine out of ten. Okay, this is the next drink. Oh, I think this is peppermint white mocha. I happen to pick the peppermint white mocha in a warm version. That's still pretty good. It doesn't make sense to have a frappuccino when it's really freaking cold outside. I can never do hot things during the heat, but I can do ice things during the winter. That makes sense. I don't even know who cares, right? <laughs> it's gonna, like, I don't even know what you're talking about. I thought it's like a vlog I should talk more. I don't know. Gosh, this is so hard. Dude, I'm stress it out. You're literally overthinking it. <sighs> you can do this, Chris. <laughs> Let's try the next drink. 
<laughs> you like scratching so loud. <laughs> yeah, the Sony picks up everything. <laughs> Even my leg scratching. <laughs> I like the ice one better. Seven out of ten. A toasted, toasted white mocha. No. I thought it would be. Wait, like, what makes it toasted though? Yeah, uh, five out of ten. <laughs> Not memorable. <laughs> Next one, please. Yeah, I give this like a seven point five. <laughs> getting delusional here. <laughs> I don't drink coffee. Like I'm already moving. <laughs> I want to go dance. <laughs> I give this a seven point five. Or see, this is a good pile for me. Okay. I agree with you. Whatever you want. No, you can't agree with me. You have to have your own opinion. Uh, that's pretty holiday vibe. Maybe you should close your eyes like what they do in Ratatouille. Try with your eyes closed. Ratatouille? Cue the music. Honestly, these would be kind of sick together. Let's create our own drink. Ooh. Together it's a 10. Try it. It's like a pastry. Tastes like a cinnamon, pumpkin, like really good pie. Oh. <laughs> I think together that's an 11. This is pretty good. <laughs> together. It literally tastes like a French pastry. Individually, uh, six and um, eight. Do you agree? Oh, seven. Six and seven. Three. Yeah, I agree. Cool. I think that's, I think that's pretty but good. this, Right here. Sifan. Okay, this is the peppermint mocha. Why don't we have another peppermint one? <laughs> I'm so tired. Wait, no, this is a peppermint mocha versus a peppermint white mocha. Ah. Uh, okay, basically this tastes more like coffee, the white mocha. I'm trying to find a photo. Okay, fine. So this is a peppermint white mocha, warm peppermint white mocha, ice, but it tastes better ice. However, this peppermint mocha tastes like a hot cocoa peppermint. Yeah, this one's really solid and warm. This is the last one. We saved this one for last. The tall apple oat crisp frappuccino. You taste a little bit of caramel, you taste a little bit of apple, but the apple tastes very artificial. But and you taste the oat milk, so it's a little bit like Nutty. That's an example of what when our dad would say, like when restaurants do be doing too much, it ruins it. I think that's too much. Let me taste because apple goes well with caramel. Fake or not, apple. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> that tastes like an apple cinnamon pop tart, bro. Like a cider. Yeah, Chris. <laughs> Well, that concludes our video. It was a lot of milk here, so I think our next stop will be the toilet. Let's rate oh. it from the best to the worst. I'm lost. This is our rating. So first up, in first place, na -na -na, the tall ice peppermint white mocha. Second place, we have the- um, Short peppermint mocha. Short, yeah, peppermint mocha. The chocolatey um, one. Third place, we have the combination of the pumpkin spice latte with the uh, cinnamon, dolce. cinnamon dolce. Then um, fourth, we have the warm peppermint white mocha. The caramel brulee latte goes before the toasted yeah. white mocha. And then we have the passion tea lemonade. Yes. And these are the oat, apple oat crisp frappuccinos and sugar cookie almond frappuccinos. Yeah. And they're both trash. But these are all good. Yay! Yay! I'm leaving. My brother, it has to go now. Bye, Gaga. Love you. Oh, I love you. Thanks for letting me stay. Love you. Love you. I'll see you in Taipei. Thanks, New York. It's been real. <laughs> Back to San Francisco. Taiwan next? Love you. Love you. Have a safe flight. Thank you. Say bye. Bye. Hmm. <laughs>